Okay. It's really dark in here. Oh, there we go. Okay. So, when I came home and shared with you that MMM was going to do a sex study, what did you think? <laughs> what do you mean, what did I think? What did you think? Um, hooray for Sherry. <laughs> I thought it was good. Okay, so the first question is, what did you think when I first told you that Moms Mentory Moms was doing a sex study? Yes, <laughs> finally. <laughs> Any other comment? No, I think it was a great topic. Okay, question number one. What was your first reaction when I told you we were doing a sex study for Moms Mentoring Moms? I was wondering if you were going to have a show and tell portion of your sex study. Just kidding. All right, one of the, one of the concepts that we learned is that men have three basic needs. They have the need for respect, for companionship, and for sex. If you could only choose one of those, what would you choose? A present that I want for my birthday, Christmas, Halloween, Easter, all of those, sex. Really? Yeah. What about respect and companionship? Yeah. <laughs> I'm good. Okay, our study is teaching us that men desire respect, sex, and companionship. If you had to pick only one, which do you think you would choose? Sex. <laughs> is that serious? <laughs> Is that true? <laughs> you know that? <laughs> if I offered you a choice between respect, companionship, or sex, which would be the most important to you? Companionship. Where is your favorite place to make whoopee? Our bedroom. <laughs> okay, here's the final question. What's your favorite place to make whoopee? <laughs> Anywhere when I'm with you, darling. Okay, where is your favorite place to make whoopee? Any place I can be alone with you. All right, so here's your big chance. If you had advice to share with the women of MMM regarding marriage, what would that be? Regarding marriage or the subject matter? Combination, intimacy. say that I equate our sex to intimacy so to me if I don't get sex I don't get intimacy so I would encourage you to all be more intimate with your husbands okay so here's your chance what marriage advice would you offer from a husband's perspective?
Can you let's start that one over? Just answer it. <laughs> Boy, is this is okay. I do want to know this because this is intended to be funny or no. Just answer it's not it. intended to be funny. It's whatever you want. Are you going to start over? Can you start over? <laughs> no, don't show that one. Because I have a. Okay, we'll try again. What marriage advice would you offer from a husband's perspective? I would say when there are times of conflict or times where you feel like you're drifting apart, uh, it's worth it to come back together to connect emotionally and especially physically. What marriage advice can you offer from the husband's perspective to our moms? <laughs> I don't oh, shit. That one over. Who am I talking to? The moms or other husbands? The moms. Hang in there. Stick with it. We're worth it. <laughs>